At the time of recording this video, it has been exactly 606 days since the release of Vivid Voltage. Till this day, I have not pulled the number one chase card in the entire set. So in today's video, we are going to open up 75 booster packs of Vivid Voltage with one goal and one goal only. And that is to finally pull the Rainbow Rare Pikachu. All right guys, so as you see in front of you on screen, we have 75 booster packs of Vivid Voltage. And honestly, we're just gonna go right into it because I do not want this video to be too long. Let's go ahead and get started guys. First pack of Vivid Voltage. And guys, just so you know, I will not be doing the card trick on any one of these booster packs because like I said, we have a lot of packs to get through. So I'm literally just gonna speed through these and see what we can do. Here's the first code for you guys. Moving on to our second pack. And how I'm gonna open the, up these packs, I feel like I'm just gonna do one stack at a time. So we'll start off with the left stack and then work our way to the right. We have a hollow whale lord. As far as like if we pull any hollows, ultra rares, or anything like that, I'm gonna go ahead and throw those on the side because honestly, I do not have room right now to put them up in the back. We have nothing in that one. Went on to our fourth pack, I believe. But yeah, really excited for this opening. Um, first off, because I haven't opened up Vivid Voltage in quite a while. And also, Vivid Voltage is what got me back in to collecting Pokemon cards. So I have a lot of love for this set. Next pack. Honestly speaking though, time flies because it feels like just yesterday, Vivid Voltage was released. There we go, first ultra rare, we got Pikachu V. Here is a code before I forget. Just to save a little bit of time, I'm gonna go ahead and sleeve all the ultra rares up later and stuff like that. Unless we were lucky enough to pull the Rainbow Red Pikachu, then I'll go ahead and sleeve that up right away, <laughs> obviously. Well, that is the only goal for this video, to try and pull that Rainbow Rare. Going at a decent pace right now. I apologize if you guys wanted to see the, you know, the card trick and stuff like that, but like I said, I don't want this video to be so long, so I'm just literally flying through these things. So hope you guys don't mind. Another Pikachu V, that's weird. <laughs> I mean, we'll take it though. Besides the rainbow Pikachu, I mean, if we were to pull the full art Pikachu with the pink background, and also like a full art Alakazam, a gold shiny Obstagoon, you know, something like that, I wouldn't mind. Those are amazing cards. Even though I already pulled them all, there was a Togekiss V Max right there. Yeah, I already pulled all those cards like multiple times. Um, the Shiny Galarian Obstagoon, I pulled like three times. The Full Art Pikachu, I pulled twice. So literally the only thing I want in this video is that Rainbow Rare Pikachu. Let's see what we can do, guys. Going at a great pace. We're almost done with that first stack. We're about halfway through. Nothing in that one. Got hollow electrode, okay. Throw that on the side. And make sure you guys stay tuned for the recap. It's gonna be ridiculous, hopefully. <laughs> Here we go, we got another hollow. Getting a lot of hollows, I mean. That's the thing with Vivid Voltage. It is such a great set, has a lot of amazing cards in there. But at the same time, the pull rates were super, super hard for this set, guys. Ridiculous. Oh my God, we are just pulling the hollows like it's nothing. I mean, at least we know we're getting some black um, O cards, you know what I mean? We have Orbital V, of course. But yeah, like I said earlier, this set has a special meaning in my heart because it is what got me back into collecting Pokemon cards. And um, I skipped pretty much the whole Sun and Moon era, the X and Y, and also the Black and White era for Pokemon cards. I did collect here and there during the Sun and Moon and X and Y, but not as much as I do now. Like literally I would get like a couple of packs every here and then for both the X and Y and Sun and Moon era. But Black and White, I completely skipped past. 
I didn't get one booster pack of black and white. So yeah, it's been a while, but then Viva Voltage released and I just got addicted again. And I don't see myself ever cooling down. I love collecting Pokemon cards. It's so much fun. Definitely a hobby of mine for sure. Got Minetric. I'm really curious though, guys, for those that are watching this video, um, let me know down below in the comments. Did you guys pull the Rainbow Rare Pikachu in this set? Yes, I'm gonna get jealous if you comment and say, yeah, you did pull it. But I really wanna know, I'm really curious. Because the pull rates for this set, man, like I said earlier, crazy hard. All right, first stack is complete. Honestly, we are flying through these booster packs and that is a good thing. And I'm feeling hot right now. This is like a low key, a workout right now for my hands and arms. So I'll take it. Is that a hollow? Yeah, we got Snorlax hollow right there. Giving away a lot of code cards in this video, 75 booster packs worth of code cards. So make sure you guys share, take a couple here and there. You know what I mean? But don't steal them all. Something else introduced in the set, which I'm really curious to see if we're gonna pull. I, I would've thought we would've pulled one by now, but Amazing Rares had a debut in um, Vivid Voltage. And I feel like they were short-lived. They were only introduced in Vivid Voltage and then they made its way to Shining Fates and then they disappeared forever. <laughs> which, I don't know, man, I feel kind of sad about it, but honestly speaking, if you were to ask me, would you rather have Amazing Rares or um, Trainer Gallery? I mean, I'm definitely taking the Trainer Gallery, 100%, you know what I mean? But still, I have a lot of love for the Amazing Rares. I think they were literally amazing. <laughs> that was a horrible joke. Can we seriously pull something? I mean, what's going on here? We haven't even pulled a full art yet. The best thing we pulled was the VMAX. And even though the VMAX was a Togekiss, I would still take the Pikachu V over that. Like the regular V that we pulled. There we go, we're getting teased a little bit. We got Pikachu VMAX there. Just the regular one, not the rainbow. Do you guys think we could do it? Nothing in that one. I'm sure most of you know this by now, but Vivid Voltage recently had a reprint. And I swear to you guys, like I'm not lying. I went to my Target like about a month ago. And I swear, I've seen at least 15 to 20 sealed Vivid Voltage ETBs on the shelf. It was crazy. <laughs> I've never seen anything like that before. And that's all due to the reprint. And it's crazy because you know, back in the day, like a few months ago, Vivid Voltage on eBay and Amazon, they were going for roughly like 80 to $100 for a sealed ETB. But now that they have the reprint and everyone and their mom can get them now at your local GameStop, Walmart, Target, wherever you go shopping, um, now the retail price at $39.99. So the sellers on eBay and Amazon, they dropped the prices down to like 40 bucks. So that's pretty good. So long story short, if you guys have missed out on Vivid Voltage and you wanted to open up some, now is definitely the perfect time. Almost done with that second stack. We still have not pulled a single full art from these 75 packs, which is kind of crazy. And I did get some of these packs from a booster box, also sleeve booster packs and then from an ETB. So good variety of where I got these packs from. We got a Togekiss V. Seen that plenty of times. But guys, like I mentioned every video, if you want some free codes for the game online, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button. Turn on the bell so you don't miss out. I provide them in every one of my videos. I never use them. So if you want some free trainer codes, you already know where to go. I got you guys. All right, come on. We're slowing down a little bit. 
and I don't like it. Even if we somehow don't pull the Rainbow Red Pikachu, but honestly speaking, I'm still hopeful. Still gonna be positive. But for some reason, if we do not pull it in today's video, I'm still gonna have fun regardless because I haven't opened up Viva Voltage in quite a long time. So this is definitely a treat. And like I said, I love this set so much. Even though the pull rates, they do hurt. But yeah, guys, we just finished the second stack. We are on the third stack right now. Pull card. I'm gonna put these more in the middle. Come on, Pikachu. Nope, not in that one. Speaking of Pikachu, there he is right there. I'm telling you guys, once I pull that Rainbow or Pikachu, it's over. I'm not opening up any more Vivid Voltage. No more. Another one. Oh my God, another VMAX Pikachu. That's crazy, isn't it? We're getting trolled right now. Come on, Pikachu. I need you in your rainbow rare form, please. Just give me the card, man. I've opened up so many packs of Viva Voltage. I couldn't even tell you how many packs I opened, guys. It's just too many. Way too many, to be honest with you. Oh my God. Is it even possible to pull a rainbow Pikachu out of the Pikachu pack art? I don't even think that's possible. We're gonna find out right now because we're pulling the rainbow right in this pack. Never mind. That's a Jolteon. Currently at the time of recording this video, Pokemon Go, the TCG set has been released. Been having a lot of fun opening up those uh, booster packs for Pokemon Go. And at the time of recording this video, I've still not pulled the Ditto where you can actually peel the sticker back and reveal the Ditto. So that's unfortunate. Pretty rare actually, to be honest. Speaking of rare, where is this Rainbow Rare Pikachu? You know what I mean? And I don't think we pulled a single full art, which is really freaking me out because we got a Dermanitan VMAX. But like I said, a booster box was in here, 36 sleep booster packs and an ETB for the voltage. So the fact that we still have not pulled one full art out of like 50 packs or so that we opened so far, I don't know. I find that pretty ridiculous, but that's what I was, um, that's just proving you guys what I was saying earlier about the pull rates. They're extremely hard. We got reverse Charizard. That's okay. We'll throw that in the good pile. But yeah, extremely tough for these uh, pull rates and vivid voltage, which is really unfortunate. Um, Pokemon Company, they didn't start having amazing pull rates until like Brilliant Stars. Evolving Skies had decent pull rates. Astro Radiance has good pull rates. So all the other Sword and Shield sets, horrible. Finally, oh my God, we actually pulled an amazing rare, guys. It's crazy. There's a code. I'm telling you, if we only pull one full art out of 75 packs, that just shows you guys my point. That just proves everything. Second to last pack on the third stack. <laughs> oh my God. Are we even gonna get a full art? We have to, right? I mean, there's no way we don't. Wow. All right, guys, fourth and final stack of Vivid Voltage. Should be about 20 or so packs in this last stack here. Maybe a little bit less, not too sure. This is crazy. Yeah, guys, I'm not going crazy, right? Did I pull a full art and just like accidentally skip it or something? I'm sure I would have noticed. Uh, 
I'll tell you what, if we do not pull one full art from 75 packs, then I am definitely not opening up any more Vivid Voltage, guys. I will be 100% done with the set. Another Hollow. Lugia right there. The good thing is we're going at a good pace. Another Hollow. We pulled at least like 15 Hollows. I'm not even kidding. That's where all the ultra rares are. They got replaced with holographics. Oh my God. No way. Guys. Holy sh**. Oh my God. Are you serious? We have done it. We have literally done it, guys. We have pulled the number one chase card that I've been looking for for 606 days from Vivid Voltage. We have done it. Pikachu VMAX Rainbow Rare. I gotta sleeve it up. I have to sleeve this up right away. Oh my, I can't, <laughs> my God. Guys, I cannot believe my eyes right now. Oh my God. I am so, I'm just, I'm speechless. The centering looks good on the front. Centering looks good on the back too. Oh my God, this might be a PSA 10, maybe nine. Guys, you have no idea how happy I am right now. You saw it here, right here on the channel. Do me a favor guys, drop a like on this video, share this with your friends, your family, your cousins, your aunt, your uncle, whoever. And also hit that subscribe button because this is honestly just crazy. I didn't think we we're gonna be able to do it, man but we finally pulled the rainbow rare Pikachu. I can literally stare at this card all day and end the video and I'll be fine, but we still have a few more packs. So what if we pull two? I mean, I doubt it, but can you imagine? Maybe the Pokemon company feels bad for me. They're like, you know what? Here's your rainbow rare Pikachu, but we're gonna give you another one just for making you wait 606 days. You're welcome. Definitely wouldn't mind that. Oh my God, though, I cannot believe what just happened. We literally just pulled the Rainbow Pikachu. I swear to God, guys, at first I was staring at it like in shock and disbelief. I was like, is that the Rainbow or Pikachu? I had to like blink my eyes first before I could react. I mean, that is just ridiculous, man. But yeah, this is definitely the last opening for Vivid Voltage. I will not open up another booster pack unless it comes in like a uh, collection box or anything like that. Oh, and we get a full art colossal. Nice. Which is definitely off center. Look at that. We'll take that. But yeah, man. I'm so happy. I don't even care what we get from the rest of these packs. Oh, man. What an opening. It was all worth it. <laughs> we got Dermanitan VMAX once again. Hold on, guys. I got to pull it out one more time. I mean, look at this bad boy right here so gorgeous the centering looks perfect on it too i'm definitely going to get this graded and this is never leaving my collection i am just thrilled with excitement right now god man nothing in that one that's fine looks like we have five or six more packs oh man Another amazing rare. Okay, that's cool. Got Zacian. <laughs> Sorry for not talking as much now. I'm just like in shock. I, I cannot believe we pulled it, guys. Seriously, I can't believe it. What I'm curious about, though, is like, did that rainbow rare come from the booster box, the elite trainer box, or the sleep booster packs? That's the thing about opening up all these booster packs and throwing them in randomly from different products is the fact that you don't know where you got it from. You know what I mean? I would have loved to know where I pulled it from. I'm going to go ahead and say the booster box, but I could be wrong. You never know. Xerneas Hollow. Alrighty, guys, we are on the last booster pack for the voltage. This was an amazing opening. I cannot believe we completed our goal. We pulled the Rainbow Rare Pikachu, but guys, let's see if we could somehow get some last type magic. 
We will go ahead and do the card trick on this one. One, two, three, four from the back. Oh my God. All right, let's get it. Let's see what we can get. We got Stunfisk, Energy, Whalmer, Sandile, Riolu, Pharaoh Seed, Dust Call, Reverse Opal, and a Togekiss V. Let's get to the recap. All right, guys, this is everything that we pulled from 75 booster packs of Vivid Voltage. I normally include the hollows in the recap, but I'm not gonna do it this time around. We pulled 14 different hollows and I didn't feel like going through them. So starting off with the amazing rares, we got two of them. We have Zacian and Jirachi. Going into the regular ultra rares, we got Orbital V, Darmanitan, Togekiss, I believe we got two of them, yep. We also went ahead and got Steelix, and then two Pikachu Vs. Moving into the VMAX, we got Togekiss VMAX, Darmanitan, we got two of them. Going into two Pikachu VMAXs. We also pulled one full art with Colossal V. But guys, by far the best pull that we got in today's video, which I honestly still can't believe we managed to pull, we went ahead and pulled my number one chase card from the entire set, which by the way, it took me 606 days to pull. We went ahead and pulled Rainbow Rare Pikachu VMAX. I am super happy right now, guys. You have no idea. So hopefully you enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure you drop it a like to show your support. Subscribe to the channel if you're brand new for more videos in the future. Thank you for watching. Have a wonderful rest of your day. And I'll catch you guys in the next video.